Hey Leo, welcome back. And for those of you that are brand new to my channel, I wholeheartedly welcome you. My name is Sam. This is going to be your timeless love reading. So whenever you feel drawn to the title and to the picture, that's when you know it's meant for you. It's going to be all for everyone who is single. No contact with anyone. We will see who is coming through. Um, could be a brand new partner could be somebody you're manifesting into your life we are going to see who is coming towards you on this journey i'm giving away two free personal readings for the month of november so with that being said we're obviously closing out this month those of you that are new go ahead and subscribe you can take part in the monthly giveaways it's something different each and every month November, um, two personal readings. Those two people that are randomly chosen will be able to tell me what they would like their reading to be about. December is going to be multiple love readings. Um, so with this month, new and returning subscribers, leave the word grateful down below in the comment section of each reading that you view of mine from now until the end of the month. And then at the, the very last couple days of the month, I will remind you to check your notifications, the little bell top right hand corner of everyone's YouTube homepage. Like I said, two people will be hearing from me. And I did ask a few people, what would you rather have? Multiple love readings or a monetary gift card as the giveaway? And multiple people have responded love readings. So that's what I'm gonna offer for the month of December. All right, we have an adventurous lover. Someone who's, I always see a motorcycle here. Motorcycle, I have tattoos. Sagittarius energy coming through. Someone who's very independent, who's very social. So definitely an extrovert. You know, dreams of what they want in terms of love. Someone coming in very wise, but definitely a risk, risk taker. You could own a motorcycle, they could own a motorcycle. We also have Pisces energy coming through, Leo. True believer, deeply compassionate. I really feel someone who's daydreaming. The type of relationship they want. And in daydreaming, that's a form of manifesting. This person is coming in very gentle. Someone that, you know, it's going to be easy to fall in love with. We also, again, we have Sagittarius energy coming through. Discover your own personal truth. So I feel like this person's higher self is activated. This person coming in is, you know, where they may have felt a lack of direction in their love life or they felt some sadness, where they may have felt lost along their journey. It's truly that they have found themselves. So definitely established. Could be those of you that resonate with the same sex that is coming through. We have two women here. Also interracial. Aquarius energy. So we have air, water, and fire energy showing up. It's like this person coming towards you is over like those fickle type of relationships. Those short term, they're looking for long term. All right, let's get deeper. I definitely see a leap of faith being taken. For my Leo spirit, who is coming towards them? Who is coming towards them in terms of love? The world. Brand new chapter beginning. And look at this. Any time spent alone was time that you needed. Time that you needed and time that this person coming towards you that they needed. This is the end of that time being spent alone. That cycle is finally closing. I feel such strength and wisdom in this type of energy. You're ready for this brand new beginning. Yeah, you are letting go, like I said, with those relationships that are short term. Um, maybe people that made you feel like a one night stand. Anything toxic. You're letting go of people who have betrayed you. 
You're letting go of people who have given you the silent treatment. All right, let's see what else we can get. We're also going to pull cards of timing. I'm going to pull from multiple decks to make it as personal as possible. And I'm also going to pull characteristic traits. So before I even get into the tarot, let me pull those characteristic traits. All right, let's see. For my Leos, who is coming towards them? March. So it could be a Pisces, could be an Aries. Could be March of 2025 that you're meeting this person. So I'm going to say from now until March, but I will pull specific cards, cards of timing. Yeah. We definitely have within the winter. Capricorn. Aquarius energy also showing up. Red hair and green eyes. Shoulder length hair. Who is coming towards my videos? Piercings. All right. So we have January, March, and then we have July. So it could be around your birthday. By your birthday that someone amazing is coming towards you. So we have shoulder length hair and short hair. Now remember, Leo, this could be your energy... There, there's tattoos. See, I, I'm so focused on this arm sleeve of tattoos. Average height. An athletic build. All right. Let's get deeper. Are you ready? The Hierophant. Like I said, ready for a relationship. The Ace of Wands. Strong passion and chemistry with this person. Feels like a wish fulfillment, this person coming towards you. The Four of Coins, the Champion of Cups. No more holding back. No more feeling resistant, both in your energy and this person coming towards you. It's the end of the, the delays. With the star here, strong Aquarius energy is showing up. The star, we have Aquarius here, and then we have Aquarius at the end of January. So strong Aquarius energy here. But I feel it's like an ending of the time being spent alone. and An ending of the delays of love entering your life. This is a relationship coming towards you. And it does have the potential for long term. More air energy showing up at the bottom. This is Archangel Michael with the Ace of Swords. So this is protection. This is honesty. This has got the potential for long term. Heart-to-heart -heart conversations, but being completely honest with one another. I love this. All right, Spirit, please clarify the Hierophant and the Ace of Wands for the person coming towards Leo. Champion of Swords and Six of Earth. This is a cosmic shift bringing this person towards you. And I do feel, like I said, for some of you, it's going to be much sooner than later than this person enters your life. Ten of Wands shows the burdens, but it also shows the burdens that are about to come to an end. This is you peaking the tip of that mountain and feeling like the world is on your shoulders. What happens at the tip of the mountain? Everything falls into place. It's like a domino effect. That's what's happening right now. The Ace of Wands and the Star of Spirit. Seven of Coins. This type of connection was worth waiting for. Leo, it's like you've worked so hard along your journey, especially with the type of relationship that you deserve. We also have Taurus energy here. I'm going to call out the signs as I see them. The three of wands. and Like I said, you're over the challenges. 
You're over the fickle type of offers. You're over, over feeling breadcrumbed. You're allowing yourself to think outside of the box on what you truly deserve. And I feel this person coming towards you, you're done settling. And that's when this person shows up in your life. Possibly you're seeing signs and synchronicities from the universe. So we have 7-7 seven, seven here. We have 4-4. Four, four. Why the Four of Coins and the Champion of Cups? There it is. The breakthrough. And as I stated, this person coming towards you is looking for long-term storybook ending. They're looking to be in union. For those of you that want marriage and children, they're looking for that also. This is someone who you've manifested. Someone who gets you. Someone who is on the same page of what you want. Someone who is very respectful and knows your worth. Big shift in energy to bring this in. All right. Let's see what else. Spirit. What else can you do to provide additional clarity for Leo and what is coming towards them? All right, we have the Seven of Cups, Six of Coins with the Queen of Coins. Stability, positive movement forward. It's like all that time that you've spent putting your energy, the, your best energy into people um, and getting those fickle type of relationships. This is a you finally receiving. Something that feels very magical, Leo, with the Seven of Cups there. Almost like meeting this person seems too good to be true. There it is. We've got the star, the high priestess. The seven of coins and the seven of wands. So we do have seven, 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 seven here. For some of you, this is a spiritual connection. But for others, it's like you want to take your time getting to know each other. You want to take your time developing that trust between each other. And you're going to finally realize within this person why certain things didn't happen with other people throughout your journey. Realizing that this type of connection coming into your life was worth waiting for. Very strong air energy. All right, Spirit. Can I please have a timeline? You did give me January, March, and July. For Leo meeting this person at the holidays. Could be around the new fiscal year, 2025, and then till May. In progress now. So by your birthday of 2025, there is someone amazing coming towards you. Someone brand new, someone that you're very eager to welcome into your life. Someone that you feel the potential long term to be with. This is amazing. We have T N W E A O J B. So take what resonates. Leave the word grateful down below. Anytime you want me to tune into just your energy, the link to my Etsy shops in the description box. Most of you already know this. There is a cyber sale going on through Etsy for the holidays. So I jumped on board. There's multiple readings that are discounted right now. And this sale will end the very beginning of December, at which point I'll go down to just emergency readings throughout the month of December and completely reopening um, with every reading available you know, around January 1st of 2025. But you could still get an emergency reading through with me through December. The sale, like I said, is going on and just will be another week or so. All right, so much love and light, guys.